Let me show you how easy it is to create an applique that has a bean stitch or a triple stitch running on top of it to either hold the wide satin in place or to give it a different decorative look. The first thing we want to do is start a new design, go into create mode and select a true type font that is fat enough to be our applique. Our lettering object is placed in the screen and we can size it using the handles. We now need to set this object to be an applique shape. The applique shape properties are shown in the lower right. This allows us to turn on or off the fabric preview and adjust the width and densities of our shape. Changing the color for the applique position changes the color of the fabric. This completes our satin applique, but we want to add a bean stitch on top. To do that, we're going to select our object and go to copy and paste and then change that pasted object properties from the applique to a running stitch. Here we can adjust our running stitch properties, such as the type of stitch or its stitch length and how many times it passes. And again, we're complete. If we'd like this to have a contrasting color, we simply need to select it and go to the color chip to select a different color thread. And that's how to create an applique letter with a satin stitch and a bean stitch on top using Embrillion Stitch Artist.